Hi, Laurie Brook here, founder and director of Our Children Australia. Welcome back. This week we're talking about birthdays and in particular, it's your ex's birthday. Um, before we move on to this topic, what I want to talk to you here is, you know, yes, it's your ex's birthday and you're no longer in a relationship and I'm not about to suggest that you continue to celebrate each other's birthdays. Um, but more importantly, how the children anticipate birthdays between um, their parents you know it's mum's birthday coming up can we talk to dad about that and vice versa if it's dad's birthday coming up can we talk to mum about that can we share that joy and excitement that naturally comes along with birthdays um, so when the birthdays you know coming soon it's you know it might be tomorrow it might be next week but it's in the near future and children get excited about things early on. Um, they know that birthdays might mean birthday cakes, it might mean birthday cards, maybe presents in your household, I don't know. But there's that natural excitement and joy that comes with celebrating a birthday. Um, and kids love to get involved in that hype. They really like to get wound up in the excitement that comes with that. So you might want to start early talking about what are you going to do for mum's birthday? What are you going to do for dad's birthday? Um, you might want to suggest that they make a birthday card or make a present for them, draw them a picture. They might be at an age where they've got money that they can go out and buy a gift. Or maybe you want to say, well, you know, here's a little bit of money. Go out and buy mum or dad a gift for their birthday and take them shopping and help them choose something. It doesn't have to be expensive, but here it is. The thought that really matters and it's also showing your children that you know you are okay and in fact you like seeing them get excited and happy about celebrating the other parents birthday and it, that is okay with you they don't have to pretend that they don't care about that um, in the lead up to the birthday you might want to talk to the other parent about maybe if the kids are supposed to be with you about spending time with them on that day for a few hours um, if birthdays are really important to that parent, then that would be one a wonderful gesture. You know, if birthdays aren't that important in your household, then, you know, they might say, say no, look, really, it's okay. We'll do something when the kids are with me anyway, okay? Um, but the offer can go a long way. If on the day of the birthday the children are with you, get them to make a telephone call and just say happy birthday. If them record a video of them saying happy birthday on your phone and send that over. Um, really, it's all these little things that take very little time and effort on our behalf but can mean so much not only to the other parent but to the kids as well um, because they don't feel like they have to be any different in your household to how they truly want to be. I hope you found this helpful. Again, if you've got any comments, please put them below. I would love to hear from you. Bye.